Hey everybody, this is Dr. Maharaja Subramanian over here and I just wanted to know uh, and ask you, you know, like what are you subconsciously imprinting within yourself as your reality? What is it that you are subconsciously imprinting yourself with in your reality, especially if you work a lot in front of a system? That's the question. So for, so for me, what is exactly in front of my system? Because I spend a lot of time in front of my laptop. So for me, I keep my desktop real clear real clean so it's like i have a drop down menu bar uh, in my taskbar startup taskbar where i have to go and click for my desktop icons otherwise my desktop is really clean and i change i keep on changing the wallpaper in terms of keeping it in terms of quotes from really successful people and from some of my mentors that's one two i keep in the business plan or the outlook of some of the conglomerates like right now as i'm shooting you know like uh, this video the wallpaper that I'm having is that of Alphabet, the company structure of the al Alphabet, which was published in uh, by one of the magazines online. So I had downloaded that image and I'm keeping it as that as my wallpaper. So that's one thing. The second thing is also, you know, like for most of the time, I have an affirmation getting flashed or moving through across on my computer screen, on my laptop screen. There are different, you know, like uh, flashes software that's available. You can even create an image, a bitmap image or a JPEG image uh, using some of the best codes, best, some of the best positive affirmations, which gets on, you know, like fed within your mind. So what is exactly that? And these things, and these things as you are working, there are millions of receptors millions of receptors at least even if not millions it's tens of thousands of receptors are there in your eyes so you may not be looking at them consciously but yes they just keep on you know like getting fed uh, into your eyes and getting deep into your subconscious mind so that's what gets becomes your reality or your inner blueprint which ends up attracting your reality so for me this is how i do it so if you're a person who's using a system for a lot then get on and look at what exactly are you looking at it. Some of the things that I can, you know, like really recommend. Yes, there are my quotes which I will happily uh, recommend that you can have as your wallpaper. So that's one. Second, get in some of the best quotes. For who are the people whose quotes I cycle through? Uh, one is Gary Vaynerchuk. Another one is Grant Cardone. Another one is Robin Sharma. So these are some of the people whose quotes I just, you know, like cycle through as my desktop wallpaper. I also get in, you know, like whenever possible in terms of getting in the images of some of the top companies and, you know, like keep it over there. And most of the times I also have affirmations, you know, either flashing through or playing as a background video or maybe even the entire JPEG image consisting only of, you know, uh, quotes. Another thing that you can Google and find out as I'm sharing this, you know, like is the quotes by Yoda from Star Wars. Some of them are really powerful. So for nearly for one year, when I had the peak of growth, when I had to bring back myself back to work, there was something that I had as wallpaper and kept on feeding myself. So when people ask me, you know, like, where is it that you find your energy in terms of being at that top notch level in terms of working so much through? My answer is I feed in subconsciously so much of positivity and highest vibrations into my mind through my desktop. That's what I do. So that's my secret. So what's there in your desktop as your desktop wallpaper?